Lick number nine, swinging. This is a note-for-note -note transcription of Ralph Mooney's uh, kickoff solo to Swing Indoors. Uh, we're doing this in the key of B flat, and we're starting on the five chord. This is gonna include some double stops, some bends, some bend releases, and using four of uh, five chords. So let's check it out. All right, so we're starting on the five chord and we're starting with a pickup on beats three and four. So I'm starting here on the fifth and root of that F chord. And then I'm going right to this four of the five chord. So it's an F chord, but I'm using a B flat chord on top of it, which is also the same as the one chord, but in this context, it's gonna sound as the four of that F chord. So I'm using that triad up there. Easy to see down there. It looks like an A chord moved up. And I'm going to grab the top two strings. Pick is going to come across on the low string. Back to the top two. And then I'm going to resolve on the third and fifth of that F. I'm going to play this interval again, but now I'm going to add a grace note into this third with a bend. Notice I'm using three fingers to support the bend. Now I'm gonna bend into that note again, but this time harmonizing it underneath with the root. Release that bend so I have the F and G against each other, a major second interval. Sliding that down a whole step so I get the E flat and G, like the nine and flat seven. And then I'm gonna play a, a G and F, but I'm gonna use a little grace note to get into that G. And now I'm going to bend this C up to D. And get that F. Resolve on B flat. That's my, my one chord. When I get to that B flat, I'm going to make it dominant seven sounding. And I'm going to move my first finger up here on the uh, dominant seven of that B flat, the A flat. Pinky is going to be playing the fifth. Two fingers here on the C. So releasing that bend from the third down to the second, down to the root. Then I'm gonna play my second and fifth of that B flat and I'm gonna bend that second up to the third. 